Phil Murphy here alongside Jurgen DeCastro. First round knockout winner to open the UFC 243 pay-per-view. You're gone 47, 57,000 watching this, a record crowd rooting for the other guy, the one you knocked out. What was it like walking out to a crowd that was rooting for the guy you were facing? Yeah, that's what was going to my head. I say they have no idea what's about to happen. I mean, I'm, I'm ready to to break the party. And we knew that he would be emotion because, I mean, fighting in your backyard will bring you a lot of emotion, which is sometimes good, sometimes bad for you. I know he was looking for finish, and we, we, I will find the open, and I know I got power, so I just have to touch. Quite a stage for you in your UFC debut. Originally, you were lower down the card, and then injury happens to Holly Holm. You move up to the pay-per-view. What was your reaction when you realized you were going to be opening the main portion of the show? This, I mean, I, I think I'm born to do to make history and break barriers. I, I fought in, in Vegas. Then I, I'm fighting the biggest card of the year. My nickname is Matt Titan. I'm fighting Marvel Stadium. So what else? I see, and and, and I, I was I get in the plane when I got in China. I open my phone. They say, oh, your, your fight got bumped from prelims to main card. I say, well, it is what it is. Let's do it. I mean, everything was was start, was lining up for a good show, and I'm glad. I'm I'm blessed. And you hit like you had all of Thanos's Infinity Stones. Oh, I told you I'm gonna snap my finger. What, <laughs> what did the finish look like from your point of view? What did it feel like? Uh, I mean, I, I knew it was was me or him because he he know my finish people like that with the uppercuts and and so I said step back timing. If I call that that jaw will be night night. So. A very impressive. I, I want to touch him. I, I want to touch him. I saw him on the ground, so I know it was over. So I don't even throw more points. The walk-off knockout in the land where Mark Hunt made Mark that. Hunt famous. One, I'm a, I mean, I'm a bigger fan of Mark Hunt. I mean, I like the guy too. I mean, I'm a fan of all his camp. I like to tie to Vasa, Tyson Pedro, all those guys. So I'm, I'm a UFC fan. Now I'm a UFC fighter, but I was a UFC fan like a couple months ago before I get to to contender series. So I like all those guys, and it is what it is. And the first Cape Verdean to win in the UFC, what does that mean to you to make history for your country? That's big. I mean, if you know where Escavero is, like, if you know where Escavero, uh, the odds someone like me to make it to UFC is almost, like, impossible. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure the, the stadium could fill Cape Verde. So this is big for me and, and for my country and for everybody back home. It's the first on a multi-fight contract for you in a dream world. Who and when are you fighting again? I want to fight. I want the thing is I want to fight because I need money, so I need a lot. I have a lot of bills to pay. I want to fight three and three months. I don't care who, where. Just give me a fight, and I'm, I'm, if I want to do this a full time. So uh, as we speak right now, I'm still going to go back to work tomorrow. So I want to do a full time. I want to fight three and three months. If if please UFC give me a fight. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports and analysis, download the ESPN app, and for live streaming and special content. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.